Hi guys, today's video is going to be a get ready with me video. Um, I'm actually getting ready to film like a couple of videos, so I'm like, oh, I might as well just get ready in front of the camera. Um, I want to start off by saying that my lighting right now is crap and I can't get it to work. Like, it's so hot here and so sunny. It's like 5 o'clock and yet it's still so hot and so sunny on my side of the building. But I'm trying to work with like different angles and trying to get my blinds to work. So please excuse it if it looks odd for some reason. But here we go. So because it's so hot, I don't want anything too, too heavy. Um, so I'm going to use my uh, Maybelline Dream Fresh BB Cream. Um, I have the color... Light? I don't know. But it's this little guy. Got it from the drugstore. Super cheap. So, I'm just gonna apply this. This is a great primer, but it also works for pretty good coverage. I just have a couple, like, spot there, and then a couple up here. So it's just basically covering those and the redness and just evening out my skin tone. Ugh. It's so hot. I had to turn my AC off to film this, and that's. Next, we're going to conceal, and my instant ager wine is my go-to concealer. I love this stuff. It works amazing. Mine actually broke and exploded because I was fiddling with it, but I still use it, and it's in 10 fair. So yeah, it's like all in here, which is just fine because then I can use my concealer brush after. I'm going to just go down here. And usually I use my um, beauty blender, but it's so light it doesn't even need it. Okay. So there's my much more even skin tone. I didn't bring my wipes. I'm in my living room doing my makeup. <sighs> Until I get my new setup, this is kind of what I gotta do for filming. Some of that on so my lips are ready when we get to that um now I'm gonna just do my under eye brightening this is the Clinique airbrush concealer that I absolutely love kind of brighten up underneath there and this is in 01 fair love this stuff. It works so amazing. This is a super light coverage, so I can't be too picky, but, okay, perfect. Now I'm going to set all that and add a little bit more coverage with my powder. I'm going to use the Physician's Formula um, Magic Mosaic 
multicolored custom face powder, and my colors translucent slash beige. So this looks like this. It has some translucent side with some other colors. Oh, and usually a sponge in there. Um, but I'm just gonna use my Kabuki brush, which is ancient old, and I have no idea where it's from, to pat this in. I'm sorry, I feel like I'm going so slow. Perfect. Um, actually, we're pretty even today. I have been a little bit darker down below, but I've kind of evened out from hiding inside for a couple of days because it's just too hot. Sorry guys, it's just so high in water. Um, okay, I'm happy with that. But I am gonna put a little bit of color, a little bit of bronzing, but not a whole lot of. So I'm gonna use my Physicians Formula again. I love Physicians Formula. I'm gonna use the Happy Booster in light bronzer. Looks like this. And then it does have um, a pink and darker side here, which is perfect for people who I just have such a red undertone that I don't like to put red on top so I'm just gonna focus on like this half of the palette sometimes I do use the whole thing if I'm gonna put it where my blush will go if I'm gonna use it as a blush but I'm not today so I'm just gonna kind of kind of do like um where I would contour but just in a bigger area so I'm using my kabuki brush again um, not a lot, but just enough. It's going to add some coverage, help even out everything. I'm so... Ugh. I don't have oily skin, but it's just that hot. So I feel like the extra powder is good too. Okay. Perfect. Okay. So next. Do I want to contour or do I want to contour? No, I'm not going to contour because I'm going to do a really big lip. So I'm just going to put a little bit of blush on. I'm going to use my MAC Pinto Peach Favorite Blush. And use my MAC 129. It's like a dome shaped kind of thing. Just use a little bit. They're just a little hint, nothing too major. They don't like super, super pink cheeks. Maybe just to kind of blend it a little bit. And that's it for my face. So I'm just going to do a super simple eye because I am doing a big lip. So I'm going to use Painterly as my base slash actual eyeshadow. I'm going to put some of that on. I like using this because it's basically my skin tone, but it kind of evens out everything and does add some color to my lids. So I put it all over, all the way up to my eyebrows. Okay. Oh, my writing's already going. Don't leave me. No, I already look like not even. I'm just going to down these. Okay. Sorry, guys. Okay. Good as this going to be, I guess. And then I'm going to take 
my MAC palette that it is so old. Like this color is completely gone. Those two are almost gone. But this is a new color in here. What is this one called? Wedge. So I'm going to use this one here, which is a wedge, which is kind of like a matte brown. And I'm just going to use, this is just a no-name brush. It's so old, you can't even read it. This is basic eyeshadow brush. And I'm going to focus it in the crease. This is going to give my eyes a little bit of definition. Nothing too crazy. It's just super, super simple. <laughs> oh, I don't look matte, but I am. I'm so sorry. Okay. Um, curl my lashes. This is so hard without a mirror. Mm. And then my one by one volume mascara by Maybelline. my bad gal lash Ew. this one I think is time to throw out I feel like my left eyelashes are always shorter and smaller. Does anyone else have that issue? It sucks. For as long as I can remember, that's always how it's been. Ah! Curl them. Perfect. Okay, now look time. I'm going to start with. Oh, my foot is a Um, Mac Pepper and Prime lip. I kind of hit it towards the bottom of my lip, and then I'm disperse it. I'm going to use. MAC lip liner in what a blast. It's a pro longwear lip color. Oh, come on, show how pretty it is. Okay. I'm just gonna outline my lips. And then I'm going to use my favorite lip color of the moment, which is C'est La Vie by the Hey Sailor Collection by MAC. It is so pretty. It's like kind of a corally orange color, which isn't going to be true on camera, because why? That would be too easy. Okay, I'm going to put this stuff on.
And that's my look. Super simple. Mostly everything is really super simple, super light, and then just a big pop of color, which I love. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm sorry it's so long and the lighting sucks, but this is how I got ready today, and this is what I'm wearing. So I'll see you in my next video, guys. Bye.